Beta carotene, Wikipedia article audio. Beta carotene is an organic, strongly colored red orange pigment abundant in plants and fruits. It is a member of the carotenes, which are terpenoids, synthesized biochemically from eight isoprene units and thus having 40 carbons. Among the carotenes, beta carotene is distinguished by having beta rings at both ends of the molecule. Beta carotene is biosynthesized from geranyl geranyl pyrophosphate. Beta carotene is the most common form of carotene in plants. When used as a food coloring, it has the E number E160A, 119. The structure was deduced by Carr ETAL in 1930. In nature, beta carotene is a precursor to vitamin A via the action of beta carotene 15, 15 monooxygenase. Provitamin A activity Symmetric and asymmetric cleavage Isolation of beta-carotene from fruits abundant in carotenoids is commonly done using column chromatography. It can also be extracted from the beta-carotene-rich algae, Dunaliella salina. The separation of beta-carotene from the mixture of other carotenoids is based on the polarity of a compound. Beta-carotene is a nonpolar compound, so it is separated with a nonpolar solvent such as hexane. Being highly conjugated, it is deeply colored, and as a hydrocarbon lacking functional groups, it is very lipophilic. Plant carotenoids are the primary dietary source of provitamin A worldwide, with beta carotene as the best known provitamin A carotenoid. Others include alpha carotene and beta cryptoxanthin. Carotenoid absorption is restricted to the duodenum of the small intestine and dependent on class B scavenger receptor membrane protein, which are also responsible for the absorption of vitamin E. One molecule of beta-carotene can be cleaved by the intestinal enzyme beta-beta-carotene 15, 15 monooxygenase into two molecules of vitamin A. Absorption efficiency is estimated to be between 9 and 22 percent. The absorption and conversion of carotenoids may depend on the form of beta-carotene, the intake of fats and oils at the same time, and the current stores of vitamin A and beta-carotene in the body. Researchers list these factors that determine the provitamin A activity of carotenoids. In the molecular chain between the two cyclohexyl rings, beta-carotene cleaves either symmetrically or asymmetrically. Symmetric cleavage with the enzyme beta-beta-carotene 15 dioxygenase requires the antioxidant alpha-tocopherol. This symmetric cleavage gives two equivalent retinal molecules and each retinal molecule further reacts to give retinol and retinoic acid. Beta-carotene is also cleaved into two asymmetric products, the product is beta-apicarotenol. Asymmetric cleavage reduces the level of retinoic acid significantly. Since 2001, the U.S. Institute of Medicine uses retinol activity equivalents for their dietary reference intakes, defined as follows. Conversion factors 1 g ray equals 1 g retinol. 1 g ray equals 2 g all trans beta carotene from supplements. Retinol activity equivalents. 1 g ray equals 12 g of all trans beta carotene from food. 1 g ray equals 24 g alpha carotene or beta cryptoxanthin from food. Ray takes into account carotenoids variable absorption and conversion to vitamin A by humans better than and replaces the older retinol equivalent. Ray was developed 1967 by the United Nations slash World Health Organization Food and Agriculture Organization. International Units Another older unit of vitamin A activity is the international unit. Like retinol equivalent, 
the international unit does not take into account carotenoids' variable absorption and conversion to vitamin A by humans, as well as the more modern retinol activity equivalent. Unfortunately, food and supplement labels still generally use IU, but IU can be converted to the more useful retinol activity equivalent as follows. Dietary Sources 1 G ray equals 3.33 IU retinol. Side effects 1 IU retinol equals 0.3 mu G ray. 1 IU beta carotene from supplements equals 0.15 mu G ray. Excessive intakes and vitamin A toxicity. 1 IU beta carotene from food equals 0.05 mu G ray. 1 IU alpha carotene or beta cryptoxin thin from food equals 0.025 mu grae1. Beta carotene is found in many foods and is sold as a dietary supplement. Beta carotene contributes to the orange color of many different fruits and vegetables. Vietnamese GAC and crude palm oil are particularly rich sources, as are yellow and orange fruits such as cantaloupe, mangoes, pumpkin, and papayas, and orange root vegetables such as carrots and sweet potatoes. The color of beta-carotene is masked by chlorophyll in green leaf vegetables such as spinach, kale, sweet potato leaves, and sweet gourd leaves. Vietnamese GAC and crude palm oil have the highest content of beta-carotene of any known plant sources, 10 times higher than carrots, for example. However, GAC is quite rare and unknown outside its native region of Southeast Asia, and crude palm oil is typically processed to remove the carotenoids before sale to improve the color and clarity. The average daily intake of beta-carotene is in the range 2,7 mg as estimated from a pooled analysis of 500,000 women living in the U.S., Canada, and some European countries. The U.S. Department of Agriculture lists these 10 foods to have the highest beta-carotene content per serving. Drug Interactions Excess beta-carotene is predominantly stored in the fat tissues of the body. The most common side effect of excessive beta-carotene consumption is carotenodermia, a physically harmless condition that presents as a conspicuous orange skin tint arising from deposition of the carotenoid in the outermost layer of the epidermis. Adults' fat stores are often yellow from accumulated carotenoids, including beta-carotene, while infants' fat stores are white. Carotenodermia is quickly reversible upon cessation of excessive intakes. Beta-carotene and lung cancer in smokers The proportion of carotenoids absorbed decreases as dietary intake increases. Within the intestinal wall, beta-carotene is partially converted into vitamin A by an enzyme, dioxygenase. This mechanism is regulated by the individual's vitamin A status. If the body has enough vitamin A, the conversion of beta-carotene decreases. Therefore, beta-carotene is considered a safe source of vitamin A and high intakes will not lead to hypervitaminosis A. Species of carotene, molecular linkage, amount in the meal, matrix properties, effectors, Nutrient status, genetics, host specificity, interactions between factors. Beta carotene can interact with medication used for lowering cholesterol. Taking them together can lower the effectiveness of these medications and is considered only a moderate interaction. Beta carotene should not be taken with or listed, a weight loss medication as oralistic can reduce the absorption of beta-carotene by as much as 30%. Bile acid sequestrants and proton pump inhibitors can also decrease absorption of beta-carotene. 
Consuming alcohol with beta-carotene can decrease its ability to convert to retinol and could possibly result in hepatotoxicity. Chronic high doses of beta-carotene supplementation increases the probability of lung cancer in smokers. The effect is specific to supplementation dose as no lung damage has been detected in those who are exposed to cigarette smoke and who ingest a physiologic dose of beta-carotene, in contrast to high pharmacologic dose. Therefore, the oncology from beta-carotene is based on both cigarette smoke and high daily doses of beta-carotene. Increases in lung cancer may be due to the tendency of beta-carotene to oxidize, and may hasten oxidation more than other food colors such as annatto. A beta-carotene breakdown product suspected of causing cancer at high dose is trans-beta-apo-8 carotenol which has been found in one study to be mutagenic and genotoxic in cell cultures which do not respond to beta-carotene itself. Research Cancer Cataract Additionally, supplemental beta-carotene may increase the risk of prostate cancer, intracerebral hemorrhage, and cardiovascular and total mortality in people who smoke cigarettes or have a history of high-level exposure to asbestos. Medical authorities generally recommend obtaining beta-carotene from food rather than dietary supplements. Research is insufficient to determine whether a minimum level of beta-carotene consumption is necessary for human health and to identify what problems might arise from insufficient beta-carotene intake, although strict vegetarians rely on pro-vitamin A carotenoids to meet their vitamin A requirements. Use of beta-carotene to treat or prevent some diseases has been studied. A 2010 systemic meta-review concluded that supplementation with beta-carotene does not appear to decrease the risk of cancer overall, nor specific cancers including, pancreatic, colorectal, prostate, breast, melanoma, or skin cancer generally. High levels of beta-carotene may increase the risk of lung cancer in current and former smokers. This is likely because beta-carotene is unstable in cigarette smoke-exposed lungs where it forms oxidized metabolites that can induce carcinogen bioactivating enzymes. Results are not clear for thyroid cancer. In a single, small clinical study published in 1989, natural beta-carotene appeared to reduce premalignant gastric lesions, 177. A Cochrane review looked at supplementation of beta-carotene, vitamin C, and vitamin E, independently and combined, on people to examine differences in risk of cataract, cataract extraction, progression of cataract, and slowing the loss of visual acuity. These studies found no evidence of any protective effects afforded by beta-carotene supplementation on preventing and slowing age-related cataract. A second meta-analysis compiled data from studies that measured diet-derived serum beta-carotene and reported a not statistically significant 10% decrease in cataract risk.